Hi kids! Welcome to your lesson 3 of Mathematics 4 for this week. I am Teacher Zaida. Our topic for today is Reading and Writing Numbers up to 100,000. How do we read and write numbers up to 100,000? Can you read three-digit numbers? Okay, let's try. Could you read this one? Yes, that's 275. How about this one? Okay, very good. That's 628. And this one? Yes, that's 149. And how about this one? That's 493. Very good. Now, did you know that as long as you can read the three-digit numbers, then you can read numbers up to 100,000. Last time, we discussed place value and value. Now, aside from place value, that is assigned for every digit in a given numeral, every three digits starting from the right is placed in a particular period. Again, every three digit starting from the right is grouped in what we call a period. Okay, for example, the first three digits from the right, the ones, tens, and hundreds digits are grouped in what we call the ones period. The next three digits, the thousands, ten thousands, and hundred thousands digits are grouped in the thousands period. Now, how do we read this number? This is 75. And it belongs to the thousands period. So we read this as 75,000. This is 149 and it belongs to the ones period. But we do not read this as 149,1. Why? Because 149,1 is the same as 149. Did you get that? Okay, so we read this number as 75,149. And how do we write this number in words? This is how we write 75,000. And this is how we write 149. So again, this is 75,000. 149 Okay, let's try other examples. How do we read this number? Okay, that's 83 and it belongs to the thousands period. So that's 83,000. Okay, that's 261. So again, the number is 83,000. 261. And how do we write this number in words? This is how we write 83,000. And this is 261. So again, the number is 83,261. Okay, how about the next number? This is, okay, 67,900. Three, very good. And how do we write this number in words? This is how we write 67,903. Okay, how about the last number? How do we read this one? 
Okay, that's 12,418. And how do we write 12,418 in words? This is 12,418. Very good. Okay, let's check if you were able to understand our lesson for today. Are you ready to read and write numbers? Okay, this is what we're going to do. First, you read the number aloud and then you write it in words. Again, just read the number aloud and then you write it in words on your paper. Are you ready? Okay, number one. Could you read that number aloud? Okay, again. Okay, very good. That's 91,236. Now write that number in words. Go. Done? Okay, let's do number two. Could you read the number aloud? Again? Okay, that's 28,403. Now write that number in words. Go. Are you done? Okay, let's do number three. Okay, number three. Could you read that number aloud? Again? Okay, that's 16,824. Very good. Now write that number in words. Go. Are you done? Okay, number four. Could you read that number aloud? Again? Okay, that's 42,156. And write that number in words. Go. Are you done? Okay, let's do number five. Could you read that number aloud? Again? Okay, that's 98,417. Very good. Now write that number in words. Go. Okay, if you're done, don't forget to submit your works to your teacher. You did a very good job today, kids. I hope you were able to understand our topic for today. Until tomorrow, goodbye! Wait. Please click our subscribe button, then our notification bell to receive notifications on our latest uploads.